so um the thing finished with the 16 minute thing so i had to start another one yeah this is taking longer than it's usually an hour gonna need your help on this one kiddo you still got your gun you can, just in yeah. case just in case that makes a lot of noise clem you are dumb as Shinizzle. There's canned food right there. Why didn't they just... I don't think Clem thinks this up through. Good job, AJ. Is there more? Keep it coming. Okay, I think that's enough. I don't want to be too cocky. You're going to F around find another grenade. Stand. Slowly. See? Don't yell. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. I don't have to. Who are you? <clears throat> the name's Abel. And I'm hungry as hell. He's the one that robbed us. You and your friends made a lot of noise out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? You knew about this place already and organized some effort to get inside. Just passing through. Decided to see what we could scavenge. Uh huh. And you just got extra lucky. You look a little young to be out on your own. You got a group. Count you plus the two outside, I'm thinking maybe more. Tell me about your group first. <laughs> I miss the days when we were all so goddamn cagey. It's just me and my ugly face out here. Lonely, ugly, and hungry. Now. I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. <clears throat> well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? Now that's impolite. Yo, chill, 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 chill. Put Don't the gun steal. down, chill. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. Chill, chillax. Make a deal. Enough. Let's split. Chill, on, chillax. Put the I'm guns down. You. AJ, put the gun down. Put the gun down. Listen up, squirt. Chill, chillax. Put the gun, gun down. And let me go my Mary. You understand? AJ, lower the gun. Put the Bro, gun down. If we shoot home. the gun, Jr. somebody is going to die. Wise woman. Clem, we're running out of time. We need to get out of here. <clears throat> Chill. Panic. Chill. I was Chill. just leaving. Put the gun down. Chill. Chillax. Thanks for dinner. We got a can right there. He, he looked like he Who took it. Who the fuck was that? Just take a bag and fill it up. Go, 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 go. Just go, go. Oh my god, we're gonna die. This is why he said not to go. This is literally why he said not to go on the outside. Stupid mother. What happened in there? Just move. A retard fool robbed us. I won't try to get nobody killed. I chose not to die. Oh lord. We got robbed. I'm not going to use that for a trailer. But we got robbed. When is this game going to end? You are 
are not listening to me. Marlon, listen to me. I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it. Took y'all a while. How poor are they that have not patience? A Sim! Mitch! Check it out! Food! That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. That should probably warn you. Like, seriously, it's a lot. Lewis and Violet helped too. Neither of them ever brought back this much before. Neither have you. Where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our fish traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty-ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. She know him. Did he follow you? No, I let him have some food, and then we lost track of him in a swarm of walkers. You just let him take our food? What the fuck? Now he knows we're out here, and he'll come back for more. What the hell were you thinking? This is fucked. If I hadn't done what I did, he would have shot us. I made the right call. Bullshit! What if there are others? You don't know what people are capable of out there. Think again. <laughs> Brody, fam, we have way more experience than yo at, dude. We have been abused. We have been beat. We have been hit. We have been carved. We have been kidnapped. We have been tortured. We had to watch. We had to kill two friends, give birth. We had to watch a child get beat to death, and then got. I got shot twice, twice. <laughs> And what are you complaining? I got the food. I didn't know this guy was out here and gonna rob us. Jesus Christ, cut me some slack. At least you got some food. Just can't. I won't. Just not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means. Enough! Just means... There's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. You can't be serious. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible. Clem. I know I asked you for help. You did. You did. But... Shit. God. Nothing's easy. No one died. You don't have to worry. I always do, though. I can't help it. <laughs> well... At least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Um, I'll go talk to Brody. Thanks for the haul, Clem. You guys should go enjoy it. You've earned it. Don't sweat it, Clem. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe zone. She'll be all right eventually. Still? We should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. 
dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but not scary. Being a walker is a lot worse than being dead. How do you know? Maybe being a walker is really nice. I doubt it. Me too. But it's not like you can go ask one. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now, instead. Sophie was awesome at making stuff. She'd build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it too. And Minnie'd be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess death doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. Someplace safe and happy. All of us together. Looks like a nice place to wind up. Yeah, I think so too. A lot better than some. Okay, I just want to point out. <laughs> they basically went like a Christian route. And then they went to an atheist route. If you're a bad person, you go to hell. If you're a good person, it looks like a nice place to be. When you die, you don't go nowhere. We we just we, we just vanished. We just disappeared. <laughs> Cause there is a guy that um works on the, the the comic and he's atheist. So um he was the one that killed Father Gabriel. Cause he since he's atheist, he did not mind killing a pastor. <laughs> um yeah. Look, that guy might have followed us wherever wherever we might have effed up, but it's really I mean, it's okay. Cool. Who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes I draw this too. Can, can I be there? Sure. You want to be there, too? I promise I'll draw you well. Sure, why not? Oh, I almost forgot. Okay, here you go. It's yours. It's ours. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. It's clear. Time for bed, little guy. Can I stay up? Nope. Two more minutes. Tell you what, you lay down, and then we'll see. You full from dinner? Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was. I like it here. We gotta go hunting. And there were so many rabbits to shoot. Whoosh. <laughs> it's nice not driving everywhere or running away. But the ranch was nice too. Before the blood. This isn't the ranch. Do you like it? I like it. Now that I'm used to it. There's games and the walls make it feel safe. I do. I really do. It's good to feel safe somewhere. Clem. Yeah? You let that mean man go at the station. 
You let him take food from us. It wasn't right. I didn't like it. Don't be mad at me for saying that, though. Him getting away with a little food kept things from getting violent. You have to know when to fight, AJ, and this wasn't the time. It's still not right to let someone take from us. It makes us soft. So you're so tough, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Who's Mr. Softy now? <laughs> Stop! <laughs> That's what I thought. There, you gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right, give me a minute. There. Oh, that's a good drawing. He's a good artist. Your picture is good, too. Oh, I know. <laughs> so cute. So used to lugging this everywhere, never knowing when we'd find any supplies. I feel a lot lighter. Good night, sleep tight, don't let a walker bite. And if they try, I never let them bite. Come on, play it right. One time. Bang. <laughs> Good work. And thanks. There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? No, no, no. Not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. You got your gun. Uh-huh. I'll be right back. Stay safe. I was trying to see when this episode ends, but I can't find nothing on this episode. Man, I'm trying to figure out how far we are, but because we made our last session was between 10 and I can't find it. It stops right. It literally the episode stops right at um about the train yard. And that's it where we went to a train yard. Basement. It sounds like Marlin and Brody. Come here, they were arguing. This locks from both sides. Can't pick it. I have to find another way to the basement. A cellar door out in the yard. They're both arguing. How did they not hear that? They were both arguing.
Yeah, I can't. Be another entrance to the basement around here. Okay, so. <clears throat> A cellar would be near. Wouldn't it be near? No, uh, Ronnie was like. No, wrong way. Be this way, wouldn't it? Because cellar is always in the back. <sighs> Clem should have knocked on the door because I feel like I feel like the right way. something's gonna happen. That's not the right way. Grab brick. I need a brick for You have brick. <laughs> this thing? Did I hear this? I'd be like, hey, I was walking. I heard a lot of yelling and arguing and screaming out here. I went walking and couldn't sleep. This... I feel like it's going it's to end me. bad. Cause yeah, I can't find nothing. Just to see how away. far I am. How do we know he didn't follow them? You know he's not alone. Those bastards are back, and it's only a matter of time before they find us. You I know that shit. Nothing to you. God damn. There you go again, getting so mad. What do you want me to do? You're making me mad. No, we have to tell the others about what you did. There. Show yourself. Clem! I'll make sure everything's okay. What are you doing down here? In the dark. Brody and I were just talking. Go get some sleep. You deserve some shut eye. You had a busy day. I was asleep. You guys woke me up. So sorry about that. I, I didn't think anyone would hear us. You want to tell me what's going on? It's really none of your business. Go back to the dorm. We might want to listen to him. The man you met at the station, we got history. Brody, don't listen to her, Clem. She's acting crazy. Yeah. She gets this way sometimes. She's just got to tune it out. Sometimes it's okay to be quiet. I ain't crazy, Clem. We know that guy. Marlon let him take the twins. Him and his people. Brody! I thought they were killed by walkers. That's the story we told everyone. Shut up! Hey, shut Marlon up! Marlon was so ashamed hey, of what. Shut up! Marlon! Oh my uh, god! What'd you say? <gasps> she gonna have brain damage, brain hemorrhoid, brain aneurysms, seizures, what have strokes, you done? heart attacks. She gonna have Down syndrome? I promise. God damn it! Hell! Why did you say that, Brody? I told you not to say it! How? 
What can I do? Just, just stay with her. There's, there's a first aid kit down here somewhere, right? A first aid kit? Brody, it's me, Clem. Just, just stay still. Uh, who? I, I, I can't see. Clementine, remember? Clem, you're in danger. You and AJ both. What danger? Marlon will kill me if I tell. He's scared. And when he's scared, he gets angry. Don't worry about that now. Just, just try not to move. You're a good person, Clem. I would have liked to get to know you better. If those raiders come back, Marlon said he'd let him take you. Take us? To make him go away. Like he did. <laughs> like he did with ten sisters. <laughs> Brody. <laughs> You murdered somebody, fam. She's gonna turn. Marlin! And he gonna leave us to die. Please. He's gonna leave us to die. Bitch, don't do I'm this. sorry. I can't, I can't let you talk to the others. Damn it. Marlin, He's gonna live. Oh my. Won. We have a brick. We have a brick. We, we, we have a brick. There's a gap. Thing really thin. I could force it in there and lift up the latch. He killed Find her. In this dark. And I'm gonna be blamed for it. Yes, flush it. That'll help. She's gonna be turned. She's gonna be a zombie, and I'm gonna have to kill her. She's not there no more. She turned. She's turned. I hear her. She's a, she's a zombie now. I had to cut off the camera because I was at my limit. But she has turned now. Is that a... <clears throat> yes, <clears throat> this will work. Let's try not to... Let's see if we can't... If we don't have to kill her. If we don't have to kill her... And then explain what happened. We should be fine. What? <laughs> Why? So, I just got a confirmation. On July 20th, 2020, Flight Nights and Freddy's Session of Location was released on this uh, hunk of metal. And you know what? Uh, I'm about to waste my $7.99 on. Do you even know how much it actually costs? <laughs> He killed her, fam. That won't hold. Yeah, you're not buying all of that on my PlayStation. That would take up way too much of the team storage. He killed her. Okay, so Marlon got pissed off because remember how um, Michonne's children was found by a group and they were sitting there to have sex and all that stuff for that. So, Marlin here sold Tins to Twin Sisters to protect the group. The guy that we met, we have passed, they have passed with him. It's always a group that I run into that has a pass with somebody. But Marlin is a kid and sold ten Sisters for rape and sex and all that stuff to protect yeah, basically, to protect the group. So Brody down there panicking because she has anxiety. So she's freaking out, and they're like, she she has anxiety, however, and she's freaking out about all this stuff, about what could happen, who could die, who's this and that. He was gonna sell me AJ to the group if they decided to come back. So I was about to be raped, possibly, and him probably getting raped, but. I looked up the guy and supposedly he's from a group 
that does sex. So, because <clears throat> I was like, the guy they have history with, and I, when I caught the camera, I went and searched. I don't care if they can hear me. Yeah, I searched it. But I, I, was, trying to figure, I was trying to figure out when this episode go in. So I'm assuming I'm getting close since um someone just died. And I'm pretty sure Marlon, that girl right there that got smacked, he bashed her in the head with a flashlight to shut to shut her up. Use that flashlight for Freddy. Oh my god, the lights turned red now. Oh lord, I feel like I'm in joy of creation with the red lights. Like, dude, come on. I didn't want to kill her. She forced the hand of the gods. Oh, she is pissed. Clem is pissed, man. When is this when is this episode gonna end? This would be a perfect time to end it. But she is pissed. Like she is hella pissed. She looks mad. <laughs> she starts shaking. She's like, I'm gonna kill him. I don't know why I still got this light on. I'm gonna just try to finish this episode. I'm getting tired of prolonged stuff. AJ, put the gun down. Get this fucking psycho away from me. Where is she? she she's in the basement. She, she murdered Brody. What? She didn't do that. Slide on your face. See? He still got the blood on his Why face. Brody? Did you see it happen? Is she a walker now? Bullshit, Marlin! Clem! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head split open. That's a lie! I saw you kill her! What the hell is going on? Look at her hands! She's covered in Brody's blood! No, I didn't kill her. Jesus Christ, Clem. What did you do? I didn't kill her. We saved their lives when anyone else would have kept walking. We fed them, we kept them warm, and this is how they thank us. Guns being pulled and murder. Well, fuck them. Fuck, Marlin. Jesus Christ. You shoot me. What do you offer up to your raider friends when they come knocking? What the hell is she talking about? You won't do it. Cause he needs us alive. Shut up! Brody told me if Marlin was gonna give me and AJ up to Raiders in exchange for safety. The same way he gave up Sophie and Minnie. Oh my god. Shut the fuck up, Clementine! Let her talk! Brody told me the truth, and that's when Marlin killed her! Oh, cut him the fuck on! They only met up with these Raiders because Clem insisted they go out there! Quite the coincidence, isn't it? Shame, I don't believe in those. First thing she did was attack you, Ten. Think about how scared we all were when the adults left. I pulled us out of that fear. I gave us all courage again. Who are you all gonna believe, huh? Johnny come lately and her little fucking lunatic? Or me, your friend? He attacked. She didn't Bro help. He attacked Brody. He attacked Brody. He attacked Brody. Not me. Why would I attack Brody? I had no issues. I would attack nobody. 
I'm trying to stay with my child. Like, come on. Help us get food. What good is food if a group of outsiders just gonna come I'll along and take it? Luis. Lewis, don't let him do this. I mean, Lewis. Oh no, I am not involved. What? Dang I it. I like you, Clem, but I. Not me. I'm sorry. I should have Violet do it. On your own. I'm sorry. You let him shoot me. Really? Just so you don't have to get involved. I thought you were more than that. Shit. Marlin, come on, man. Drop the gun. Lewis! She killed Brody! We can't let her walk away. Clem, I... I, I gotta trust Marlin. I didn't kill I just, Brody. I gotta. I always have. He didn't trust you with the truth. He lied to you about the twins. He doesn't deserve your trust. Shut the fuck up! He getting mad. He getting mad. Okay, he got mad last time. He break. He breaking. Thank you. You don't know what you're doing, man. Come on, dude. Just so drop clearly, the gun. I'm supposed to have a relationship this with one of them. This is how adults do things, not us. So I got to figure out who Stand I want to have a relationship down, with now. Be reasonable. They all standing up for us. We never okay. killed him. We never killed you, her. You don't understand at all, do you? I'm trying to protect you. <laughs> All of you! Every fucking one of you! He's lying to you. He can't or won't protect you. Look what happened to Brooke. To Sophie, Minerva. You suck at protection. Shut your fucking mouth! I mean, I you made the right call. Them. I saved the lives of everyone in this fucking school. If they came back, I'd do it again. Excuse me? I didn't realize we were so fucking expendable. They told me they died. I had to save the rest of you, okay? You gave my sisters away. Why would you do something like that? I trusted you, Marlin. They trusted you. Easy, because he's a coward. I wanted to get them. States some kind of rescue. Honest, Ted, I just couldn't. I was, I was too afraid. You killed Brody because she knew. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't want this. I wanted to save all of you. Sophie. Minerva. We can still fix this, Marlin. <laughs> Okay. We can make this right. We'll help you. We're all family here. The only one any of us has left. Fam, okay, thank you. Put, thank you for putting the gun down. I swear, if he was going to kill himself, oh my god, this would be the darkest game yet. I know I betrayed you. All of you. Just let me leave. I'll never no, have we to can fix. We can fix this. You don't Just have to leave. Let me be. I don't want no one else to die. Memory. Just give me that, please. Fine. AJ. Cause he won't in the crowd. I knew it was AJ cause he won't in the crowd. What? I saved one for me. This I saved one for me. AJ is gonna be the death the death of us, man. AJ is gonna be the death of us.
Okay, I guess I'm not gonna show a preview, so I'm gonna just take my headset off and um I hope you enjoyed this episode of the first episode of the final season. Um I I don't know I don't know how I feel about this. Uh clearly I didn't make the full right calls because I didn't want Tim to be like that and I didn't want Lewis to feel like that and I didn't want Violet to feel like that. Um clearly I I have to go I'm uh, I'm going to have to go back and fix episode 1 is just I didn't, I didn't expect it to end the way it was going to end and with AJ killing him. I just I don't want no one to die this season. I don't want no one that I have to put my hands on to rescue to die. Now, if it's part of the game and they have to die because that's programmed, I can't help that. But my main goal is to keep Violet Louise 10 and anyone else part of this community alive. That That is literally my main goal. I usually do good with that. I do know I tried to help Luke. That was just programmed into the game. I couldn't help Jane from committing suicide because I didn't know she did that. Uh, Kenny's death could not have been prevented. Turns out that was programmed. So I, I want to keep as many people alive. I tried, I tried to keep Cat alive. I tried to keep Duck alive. I tried all three seasons. I've tried to keep people alive. And I went the one time I was doing so good was season three. With the new frontiers, and then it just ended with Gabe passing away. So it was just, I don't know how I feel. And I feel like AJ is gonna be a, a real problem. It's just, and I don't want it to be. But if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, share. This video gets at least about five likes. And if you want it to continue, please let me know in the comments down below. Um, if you want this the series to keep going um I'll probably just finish it anyway because I really like the game and I'm a huge fan of The Walking Dead and I'm also a huge fan of uh Telltale's series it's just I don't know I'm gonna, I'm gonna just go I, I, I have no words just I'm sorry I, I, I'm sorry I just I can't I I have to explain in another episode. I just I have to process all this right now, so and just figure out what I'm gonna do from here on out with this game and try and survive. Until then, love you guys. Peace out and bye.